fantastic. <laughs> now, you know, some chat show hosts, they just use the job as an excuse for meeting incredibly sexy women. Ladies and gentlemen, Kelly Brook. <laughs> Kelly, welcome. Thank you. There was a bit of a, what I thought was a raucous cheer from some of the men in the audience. <laughs> yeah, I, I hate that, don't you? <laughs> do you get a lot? I get it quite a lot, yeah. Do I do a lot of gay clubs. <laughs> I read that um, you're in a play in London yes. soon at the Riverside yes. Studios, is uh -huh. that right? Yeah, I'm doing a play called Eye Contact um, and it's about table dancing. And oh, um, yeah. Yeah, and <laughs> I play a table dancer. Um, a play like that's not been done before, so it's very new, and um, there's been a lot of hype around it and a lot of attention, obviously, because there's a lot of girls in it. Yeah. But, um, yeah, whether there's any stripping in it or not, we're not going to... You have to come and see. Oh, right, so you're not going <laughs> to... I've been doing a lot of research. I've been to, like, a few clubs and things like that. You've been to table dancing Yeah, clubs? I've been to a few clubs, and I've chat chatted to the girls to find out, you know... What are they like, those places? No, I don't... Do you know what? They're really like... A lot of them... <laughs> You've never been. I've never been. No, no I'd be too embarrassed. <laughs> also, I, I like to have things like crisps out. <laughs> you don't want to be reaching across and it's all, you know, it's in your face. <laughs> Honestly, I don't think it's hygienic. Yeah, well, they sometimes do it on the stage. There's a poll and they sometimes do it on the stage. It doesn't always have to be, like, in your face and stuff. Well, if I'm putting money in the pants... <laughs> oh, I want it here. <laughs> But I, I'd worried that, you know, they'd, they'd be squatting and stuff and walk off maybe with a, a beer mat stuck to the box. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'd feel bad, you know. Or maybe a twiggly. <laughs> yeah. You should think about that in the play, maybe incorporate a twiggly scene. <laughs> There's quite a lot. I read a bit of the play, actually, because they sent me the script so I could swat up on you. Oh, right. There's a lot of swearing in it, isn't there? There is a lot of swearing, yeah. She's, uh, the character I play, she's a bit of a loud mouth. Yeah. And, um, but I, I went along to the club and I had a chat with a few of the girls to find out, because, you know, I think people have just got this, um, this view of table dancing clubs as being really seedy and down market. Oh, but, no. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I like one in particular, which is the kind of club that this is set in. And um, actually, you know, all the girls actually dance you know, most of them have got boyfriends, they've got normal jobs during the day, and they just do it to kind of earn a bit of money, and if they're not dancing, you know, they earn really good money out of it. And um, they were teaching me a few tricks about how they kind of work out how to much to charge the customer. Yeah? So um, if you've ever had one kind of dancing around you, playing with your tie, they kind of twist it around. And if you've got an Italian designer label on there, they charge you double. If it's CNA Mr. Buyer Right, then you can get half price. <laughs> so tip, guys, for when you go. Is that right? Yes. I'm never, ever putting any more money in their pants. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe just loose change. <laughs> no one ever puts loose change in their pants, do they? They don't wear too big enough pants, that's the trouble. <laughs> They're completely losing the small change option in those jeans. <laughs> don't you think, Kelly? So the Big Breakfast, which I think most people knew about you because of the Big Breakfast, was that you lasted six months? Yeah. And they kicked just. you out. Yeah. They drove you out of town like a they dog. Did. <laughs> but I held in there till the very end. I mean, yeah. I knew it was coming, and it was just one of those things I just thought, you know, I can't leave. I just got to just stick it out. You know, it's just awkward. You know, we get up in the morning, read the paper, there'd be like a big article about how bad the show was, and it was just like, it's really yeah. hard to go on and do a show when you've just read that. And like, I'm sitting in makeup and I'm listening to the radio, and you know, they're talking about me on the radio, and it was like, and then you've oh, got to go that on. Is and, terrible. and it is, but you know, I'm glad it happened like that because. It can't get any worse than that, you know. I've had it from the beginning. That was my first TV job, and it was kind of... And I got slated so badly. You know, whatever I do now, I'm so used to it. I'm kind of... You know, if I see a good review, that's like, oh, my... You know, I can't believe it. Oh, it so. still hurts, Kelly. No! <laughs> <laughs> now, the other big deal um, recently was that you wore that dress. Oh, I hate that phrase. Everyone... What, that dress? <laughs> yeah, that's... We've got a clip of you in, in, in that dress. No, you haven't. Yeah, well, honestly, we have. <laughs> this is just, I brought it from my house. <laughs> Let, let's see Kelly in, in the posh frock. This is you and No! That is a hell of a... Oh, it, I didn't know it was showing that much. It shows a lot, doesn't it? Look at oh. the cameraman getting in there. Look at him. <laughs> Your hair looks lovely, though. It's fake. Is it fake? <laughs> yeah. No, I thought... Oh, that's a let... Oh, oh, my God! Oh, that, that's a short <laughs> oh, size. Stop that! <laughs> 
And there was Michael Portillo as well. It's not often you see two clean-shaven ones in quick succession. <laughs> So, um, you're all right. <laughs> but when you wear something like that, you know you're going to be in all the papers and stuff the next no, day. No, you don't, because you don't know what's going to happen that day, you oh, know. Oh, come on. No, you don't know, do you? So you think perhaps I can just sneak in here and know what I'm You hear people oh. saying, is that a beer mat? <laughs> that was my boyfriend's premiere. I had but to he wasn't something. there. I know, I had to make up for the fact he wasn't there, didn't I? And did that make up for it in some way? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he liked it. Yeah. But he wasn't there. He wasn't there. I mean, you look fantastic in that oh, dress. Thank you. No, God bless you for wearing it. I wouldn't have. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you know, and all yeah, that, all that preparation you had to. <laughs> did, did you pluck or raise? <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to answer that. <laughs> don't answer that. No, um, you're courting, aren't you? Yes, I am. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And you go out with Jason Statham. Yeah. And he used to be a big um, swimmer and... He was a diver, he was a high Was he? Diver. That's handy. Yeah. <laughs> I do that every time, I believe it. <laughs> oh, you chose well, didn't you? I not for it. No, but... Um, yeah, he was a high ball diver and, um, yeah, and that's how he got into acting and right. stuff. And he was in the Commonwealth Games as well, not just a... Yeah, yeah, I didn't know him then. No. No, but I was... So, how did you meet? Um, we met in uh, Santorini in Greece. We were both modelling at the time. From his dive, and he got spotted and asked to do a commercial. And he did a bit of modelling, and we was both out there doing a shoot. And he was there, and we had some mutual friends, so we just started chatting, and it happened. I kind of knew him before he was in Lockstock, and he knew me before the Big Breakfast. So, it was kind of nice that we got together yeah. before all that happened. And, you know, we got a nice house, and it's all very nice. And I'm very settled, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't chatting you up, for God's sake. <laughs> Don't you kid yourself, madam. <laughs> You're only 20, aren't you, Kelly? Yeah, I am. 20? Yeah. The opening night for my play is my 21st birthday. Yeah? So I'm going to have lots of journalists kind of looking at me on my 21st birthday, which is a bit grim, but we're going to have a big party after. So if you're going to come down, you should come on that night. Right. I really do hope it's a big success. Thank you. Because you took a lot of uh, crap on uh, when you left Big Breakfast. I'm glad you've bounced back big time. Mm -hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, Kelly Brook. <laughs> All right. We'll be back in one minute. Take you there, and you and I'll be dancing in the cool night air. <laughs> atmosphere, I love a party with a happy atmosphere. So let me take you there, and you and I'll be dancing in the cool night air. <laughs> so, is he diving tonight, or...? <laughs>